7 de julio, 7 y 10 de la tarde. Hoy nos toca partido clave contra... Bueno, no sé contra quién es, pero es partido clave porque podemos alcanzar a Larry Pájaro en el número de puntos históricos con 27.000 y pico. Pero os voy a contar una mala noticia y es que no lo vamos a poder hacer porque nos faltan 80 puntos. Así que nos han puesto este porque estábamos cerca de hacerlo. Pero ya os digo yo que nos va a costar dos partidos. Nos va a costar dos partidos. Vamos a comunicar en X que estamos en directo en Twitch en mi carrera. NBA 2K24. 2K24. Puedes verme en Twitch ahora mismo. Ya estamos. Ya soy todo vuestro. Cierro el iPad y allá vamos. Como os digo, contra Milwaukee. Nos obligan a jugar contra Milwaukee. Fuera. Porque nos faltan... Creo que Larry Pajar eran 27.000 y pico puntos. Hey there, superstar. Go get him. Yo, MP. I was hoping I'd run Desafío into. diario. Asistencias espectaculares, tal, eso no lo vamos a hacer. Eh, vamos fuera, jugaremos de verde. Efectivamente, vamos a cambiar de zapas. Apariencia, accesorios en la pista, zapatillas. Y nos vamos a poner, ya que jugamos de verde, a Jason Tatum 2. A más boys. Vale, pues ya estamos. Eh, realmente contra nuestro ex equipo con Antetokounmpo, Lilar Portis Jr., Allen y Tauron Prince. Y nosotros vamos a jugar. Perdón que me he equivocado de menú. Como todavía siguen lesionados el señor Brown y el señor Walsh. Pues vamos a jugar con Giddy, White, Montero, Paolo Banquero y Eva Mobley. Holiday Galloway Rice, Javari y Alperen de suplente. Allá vamos. Eh, no tengo que hablar con la Coach Warren, ¿no? A ver, que no me deje hablar con la Coach Warren. Eh, igual me da algún consejito algo, no puedo hablar con la Coach Warren. Ay, solo cojo el 3% de los rebotes de mi equipo. Este paupérrimo. Ahí está. Jugamos en Milwaukee. Obligados, partido clave, salón de la fama, la máxima dificultad. Ya sabéis lo que eso significa. Que nos lo va a poner la máquina hoy. Bobby Portis Jr. es el mejor a la pivot de la historia. El mejor pivot de la historia. Ya veréis. Y de Yanis ni te cuento. Recordad que nosotros hemos jugado en este equipo. Nos fuimos drafteados por los Milwaukee Bucks. Y aquí ganamos nuestro primer anillo. Pero solo un romance de una noche o de una temporada en este caso nosotros queríamos jugar en nuestro equipo verde y lo hemos hecho durante tres temporadas esta es la tercera y la idea es ya irnos a un tercer equipo a otro de nuestros equipos de toda la vida somos un tallas para ir en Utah a ganar tres anillos más por lo menos o cuatro anillos si conseguimos eso estamos tirando fatal podemos superar a Michael Jordan y además habremos conseguido algo que nunca hemos nunca conseguido en la historia que es que Utah ya tiene un anillo y estamos listos para un NBA de aquí con Grant Hill y Clark Kellogg bueno, vamos a verlo tenemos que llegar a 21.792 puntos y tenemos 21.703. Nos faltan 90 y... bueno, 89. Imposible en un solo partido. Este y el siguiente serán partidos clave. 
We could see a lot of buckets tonight. Two offensive teams going head to head. Por lo menos todo el equipo de Milwaukee es de jugadores de la NBA reales. Eso por lo menos es interesante. Which team is going to be able to stiffen up at that end of the floor? Looking at the starting five for the Boston Celtics. Derek White out there with Josh Kidding. Then it's MP. Dos más uno. And it's Van Carroll in at the fourth. Primera jugada hacemos un dos más uno. Fire up the whole team. MP challenges the defense and comes away with the hoop and the harm. And what an incredible achievement from MP recently. Grant, he turned in one of the most efficient games you will ever see. Well, you talk about what it means to dominate. MP was the definition of that with his performance. Now, everything fell for him, and it looked like he was a man amongst boys. Now man here's Lillard amongst boys. From deep three-point land. Mobley grabs the board. And Carroll passes to Giddy. Montero. And MP throws it down. Punto número cuatro para mí. Exactly what they want. MP with an attack on the rim. He mirado si me podía comprar más zapatillas. Ya mis con banquero. Os pues lo he dicho antes de empezar el partido. Bobby Portis hoy va a ser el amo y señor del calabozo. Es increíble. Es que es increíble, macho. Montero, the pass to Mobley. And Mobley throws it down. I mean, MP understands how to read a defense, including how to spot open guys. Mobley throws it down. 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 Mobley la corta Prince. Lillard outside. Here's Portis. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got four Portis assists now tonight. Lillard's passing ya. game, a thing of beauty. Got that ball to a guy who had a quality look and got it to him on time. Punto número siete. When he gets the rim in his sights, it's tough to stop. So aggressive and a determined finisher. Nice. And guys, I like the fact that he chose the one hand tomahawk slam because you get a little higher when you go off one hand and one foot. And Milwaukee has possession, following the bucket by the Celtics. Van Carroll right side. Mobley left side. MP up top. Pass to White. Back to MP. Mobley a screen on Prince. Montero the pass to Mobley. Ah, hemos perdido. On the break. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Bien, falla Lila. Rebound, Celtics. They put up a nice win against Sacramento last time out. And that one, the other team could not keep up with them offensively. Bien, mi segunda asistencia, Paolo. Bueno, la segunda mía, la primera Paolo, la primera fue Mobley. Once that happens, then you're in trouble. Here's Lillard. The Celtics making their last shot. Prince finds Ana de Cumpo. Misses the three. Beyond the arc. No. The shot, no good. And so it's Lillard who brings up the ball for Milwaukee. Trailing by two. They defeated Washington in their last game. Yeah, they hit the court last game with some serious attitude, especially on offense. And you know, confidence is key there. Um, they seem to play with a ton of it, especially on the offensive end. Ah, zero de dos. Milwaukee has gone one for five from three-point range. Zero de dos en triples ya. Hay frío. Kicks it out to Ana de Cumpo, and here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Good. And Ana de Cumpo gets the assist. Giannis's teammates know he's selfless. He's going to get the ball to the open guy, and it's on you to find your shot. Well, Clark, we know what Bobby Portis brings to the table. He loves the ball. Yeah, he does, and he does it with a smile, with great passion and energy. And we do know that he'll give you double-digit points, and he'll stretch the floor with his three-point shooting. A nice shot by Lillard. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Bucks. Well, their hands resulting in plenty of steals in the early going, keeping the opposition there off balance. And you know another thing that's been working for them tonight: scoring off turnovers, points off miscues, 
They've been converting any mistakes at the other end. And so it's Milwaukee with it, following the bucket by the Celtics. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. And the NBA playoff picture has really come to focus. Chris Clark, it's nice for the teams that already have their spots locked down. Yeah, I agree. I mean, it's a huge benefit for those teams to be able to give guys a rest in the last few games. Very valuable. It makes a big difference going into the playoffs when you can be rested and ready. Now here's MP. Had a career game his last time out. Bucket after bucket. Deflects the pass. Ooh, stolen by Allen. Oh, there's the alley. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Celtics. Yeah, and here's the guy who's been coming. playing his heart out. And it's earned him the Player of the Month award for the East. MP. Oh, it's been so much fun to watch him on the offensive end recently. He's really his team's engine on that end of the floor, sparking plays and helping them find open shots and big points. Now here's Giddy. Yet to see a basket. Screen by MP. And Carroll with it. He's picked up by Lillard. Here's MP. No sacamos la falta. Boy, patrolling the paint well, protecting the rim, that's exactly the kind of defensive effort you need against him. Lillard passes to Portis. Mobley with the block. Pass to White. Jacks up a three. He Bien, empatamos el partido con un triple de White. Well, he might not be a pure shooter, but he's a very steady one. I like that. They're getting White something in rhythm here. Out of Kumpo, the pass to Lillard. Over Giddy. And it's Lillard that time on the assist by Out of Kumpo. Lillard's got nine. Trading the lead back and forth. Neither side is willing to back down. Yeah, and the lead has changed hands and it just hasn't stayed in those and hands. Very long por vez el back and forth we go. Good execution. They're getting some short range looks here. Milwaukee is gone just two for six from the arc here in the first. Lillard against Kitty. On to Kumpo inside. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Celtics. And heading to the 2K leaderboard. Since the All Star break, these guys cannot miss from deep. MP number one. Second is Paolo Bancaro. And these two have been flat out torching the nets from distance. Anytime either of them gets a chance to fire from deep, they do it without hesitation. Giddy passes to Mobley. There's the three. The shot's good on the assist by Giddy. Giddy's got three assists tonight. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. Well, I'm gonna credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Now here's the buena pantalla. He's got nine. And the box hit again from deep. Scoring well this quarter. Minutos. Picking up steam as he goes. To the paint. And MP Bien, it punto número 13. Well, Había empatado Lillard con ese triple. And we're seeing that first hand in this one. Lillard against Kitty. Floats one. There's the block. <laughs> Bancaro outside. Tough call for his coach. Second foul already. Tanta. We'll see how much the staff trusts him. Bagley's checked in for the buck. Yo también me voy al banco. Perdemos de una. Perdemos de uno. 30 seconds left in the first quarter. Highland, the pass to Jackson. Now here's Ana de Kumpo. And so far in this one, two for four. Boy, the tres. overwhelming strength of Giannis just excels at fighting his way through the defense. Very impressive. Shengun with it. Eight points in his last time out. MP left side. Oh, if I jump. No good with a jumper from the wing. Oh. Boy, he's got to be mal, disappointed mal. in the result. It's good! ¿Qué ha sido eso? El segundo partido consecutivo me hacen lo mismo. Qué vergüenza. Está claro que 
Vamos a dejar que los equipos rivales hagan el battle beater. Vamos a decir Celtics right up against you. So the Celtics five right now. And we've got Alperon Shangun, Smith out there with MP. Then there's Drew Holiday. Working that pick and roll action superbly. Shangun knows exactly where he needs to be. Jackson for three. Rebounded by the Celtics. Last time they met in Boston. In their last game against this opponent, they secured the win because their second unit really stepped up. And you know what? If they run away with this game like they did in that one, uh, I'd expect to see plenty of minutes again for the guys coming off the bench. And we got assistencia. Boy, showing great command of the two-man game there. MP delivers the pass on time and on target. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Kings was all business. He picked up 54 points and did what he always does. He got others involved. He was locked in all night long. We'll see if that. Miento mi primer triple. Sí, señor. He was a one-man show in that one, Grant. Yeah, he was not going to let them lose that game. Vamos ya uno por delante, vamos. Otro bloqueo. Yeah, you know, every night's different. They may try to double him. Might force him to adjust. Or force him to make plays with the pass instead. We'll see. Second quarter here, just over a minute and a half played. Inside, here's Smith. Cash. Bien, it's MP picking up the assist. Jabari. MP's got five assists in the game, and so it's Highland with it. He brings it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Nothing on offense from them yet in the second quarter. Pass to Ante Kumpo. Down low. Can they get it? Jackson can't get it to go. The Celtics with the lead. Montero, the pass to Smith. And ah. it'll go. His first miss. Oh, He's yeah, yeah. To the inside. That shot is off. Good D by Shangun. Jackson against MP. Outside Holiday. Back to MP. Canasta. Bien, 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 bien. Hemos ido a cinco. The Bucks making a switch here. Clark's checked in. First and assist. And they're ranked first in shooting percentage, proving how lethal and connected they are on offense. They play for each other. No individual agendas out there. And it's no secret the league is definitely more offensive oriented nowadays. And they are the best of the bunch in following that trend, leading the league in points per game. And this guy to me embodies determination. Small at his position. He still gets up and keeps plays alive. That's mind over matter for sure. Launches a three and a great assist by Anadokounmpo, and that one goes in. Anadokounmpo's got three assists tonight. Boston's gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. MP against Clark, Montero. MP on the team. The team hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Highland finds Ana de Kumpo, and here's Jackson. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Now MP, give him 20. Inside. Bien, y activamos otro gol. Why we have those breakaway rooms, dude? He risked pulling the whole thing down to the floor right there. Boy, that was a great dunk, and we've got a great game here. To the paint. Oh, Clark with the slam. His playmaking is something to watch. Threading that pass right in there. Todo esto para ganar de dos. Highland against Holiday. Pass to Rice. Here's Shengun. And it's Bagley with the rebound. 
Clark outside. Here's Ana Dacumpo, covered by Smith. Here's Bagley. Rebounded by the Celtics. Smith's got a six rebound. No, me quedo corto. The shot by Montero, no good. Milwaukee is going ah. one of four from three-point land here in the second. And when it comes to Giannis Antetokounmpo, such a lovable player on and off the floor, Clark. Yeah, he really is. I mean, he's just such a carefree, gregarious, outgoing personality. Somebody that doesn't take himself too seriously. And he likes to tell his fair share of dad jokes, too, which is pretty endearing. Outside Holiday, pass to Shangun to the middle. Se acabó la falta. Brandon Clark. That's on Brandon Clark. Well, we talk about how much confidence matters for a player. Clark, it can make all the difference. It is a huge factor, a huge component. What's going on in your own head? Because you're in your head more than anybody else. So confidence is critical. And coaches, I don't necessarily know if they can give players confidence. But I think they can take it away. Los equipos con el quinteto, sure los quintetos titulares. Part of a coach's job, I think. Anadakumpo inside, guarded by Bencaro. You wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass. It's clearly been their edge, and in a close game like this, you look like they're going to find. Milwaukee has gone seven of fifteen from distance in this game. Anadakumpo, the pass to Lillard. The three. Mobley grabs the board. Mobley's got his eighth rebound here tonight. And here's no. MP from outside. Oh, I know, he came out today planning to do mm. as much damage from three-point range as possible. Well, it looks like it's time to change up the plan, guys. Pass to Prince. Shot from the wing. It's rebounded by Bancaro. Bancaro's got his fourth rebound in this one. The shot Oof. by Montero, no good. And it's Lillard with the ball for the Milwaukee Bucks. No good on the triple. Well, it looks like he's cooled down a bit after hitting those two. Otro que fallo. Again, Uno de siete. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Giddy against Lillard. Pass to Portis. And Mobley with the block. And they'll get another chance. On an Akumpo for three. Oh, almost had a four-point play right there. But he'll go to the line with a chance for three. You really have to appreciate and respect the spirit. Giannis plays the game with a beacon of energy and enthusiasm for his team. They all feed off of him with an attitude of joy and unselfishness. And he's good on the second. Well, Clark with his mix of power and length. At times, Giannis can seem unstoppable. You know what? Not often is it that one guy forces teams to reconsider their whole defensive game plan. But Giannis forces you to build the wall because you don't want him getting downhill or he'll make you suffer the consequences. And that's how you defend. Glad we had a chance to see a replay of that block again. And this is exactly why he's out here, in order to block shots in tight games like this. Vamos a sacar falta. ¿Cuántas que me está llevando para las nueve? Se hizo triples. Lillard con el ball. Ahora guardado por White. Lillard contra White. Shot clock at five. Here's Portis. And then Portis with the dunk. Pata Bobby Portis. I feel bad for those rims. Because Portis has no mercy on him. Throwing it down with force. Out left to the wing. Mobley down low. Portis on him. Mobley, no good. Milwaukee has gone just one of six from the perimeter here in the second. Here's the pick. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Oh, down low. The Greek freak. You know, that's a nice little shot to have in your repertoire. Just a lovely touch on that little flop from Ante Tocumpo. Alta, dos más uno. Se acaba una falta de Yanis. We'll try to make it a three-point play. Bagley's checked in for Ante Tocumpo. The Celtics also with a shot. Shengun checked in for Bencaro. Metemos. 
Yeah, what you like about MP is how hard he worked to put himself in a position for success. Allen finds Portis. Now Lillard. He's guarded by White. Off target with the three. It's clear he's totally out of sync. The team needs to rethink its strategy around what to do with him. Oh, look at MP doing his thing down there. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. White against Lillard. Bagley a screen on White. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. It's rebounded by Shangoon. Shangoon's got four rebounds in the game. He against Allen. Now here's MP. Guarded closely. Down low. Mobley. Saca la falta Mobley. Qué pena que no ha metido. Lleva el tercero. Ya me siento. Por segunda vez ya. Ganamos de tres. Boston calls time here. And while we have a second, let's take a quick peek at the rebounding numbers for Evan Mobley. It's not a great trend for him. Not rebounding nearly as effectively anymore. Maybe it's his effort, or who knows, but that's something that needs to change. Pass to Ben Carroll. MP against Prince. Ben Carroll with a screen on Prince. Montero, the pass to Ben Carroll. Ben Carroll eh, uses his Montero size down Banquero. there. The offensive talent, the ingenuity, size, strength. Ben Carroll has a full book bag, folks. Now here's Bagley. It's Portis, high post. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Knocks down the long J. Lillard's got 18. They're going to have to pay more attention to him on the perimeter. He's hit four three-pointers already today. MP against Prince. Van Carroll with a screen on Prince. Van Carroll outside. The three. Good. Bien, nos sale el pick and pop con Banquero. Para el triple. Que yo no los meto, que los meta otro. seconds left in the first half of this game and out of bounds the Celtics will take it Clark has checked in for the Bucks. and we've got 28 seconds left to play in the first half here's Montero that's 29 for him there's 14 seconds left in the second period Van Carroll, so good at absorbing contact. He's got a great body, knows how to use it, and finishes as a result. Vamos. Now here's Lillard. One second left. He got it up in time. Bien, 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 bien. Vamos ganando. Vamos ganando. Es hora de buscar un. Único triple que hemos metido. Esta no, por ejemplo. Si se veía Yanis, vamos. He was dominant this quarter. Ganamos de siete. Back to the game after this break. Ganamos de siete. Uf. Si hay, si hay alguna.
Como en, en el directo. No nadie en el chat. A ver qué comentan Shaq y los demás del partido. Hello everybody. We'll break down the action shortly, but first a glance at how the Eastern Conference standings are stacking up. Digo que no está, o sea que está ahora mismo en play-in. Podría ser, no, podría ser un rival en primera ronda. Porque puede ser que quede séptimo u octavo si, está, si entra por play-in. Bueno, si entra décimo. No puede ser séptimo, solo puede ser octavo. O sea, creí que la fallaba el banquero. Se ha hecho ocho asistencias, eh. And that's a wrap on half time. Thanks for watching. 18 points, 7 assists. We have 29 points, 8 assists. Está yendo bien el partido, pero es partido clave, salón de la fama, máxima dificultad, no se puede jugar más difícil. Todo esto que te hago lo que queréis en el 2K24, pero no se puede jugar más difícil de lo que juego yo. Así que a veces la máquina nos hace cosas como la del primer cuarto, claro. The Celtics with the lead. Giannis and Portis work together inside. Damian Lillard out there with Grayson Allen, and it's Prince in at the three. No, no, no. That's the group for Milwaukee right now. We knew that he was going to put it on the floor. Allen finds out he's going to be very solo and with time to put it on the floor. The shot by Lillard, no good. And Kitty has got the ball here for the Celtics. Seven point game, biggest lead so far. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Ali LaForce. Well, Damian Lillard embraces the big moment. Sacamos la falta. La tercera de Teoron Prince. I'm always talking to myself like, quote, I have to find a way. This is an opportunity to rise and to come up big. You've got to get it going. It's a real thing. You just demand that something extra of yourself. Brian? Tres años que estabais en MVP, MVP aquí, cuando tiraba yo. Ahora meto puntos en contra. Venga, nueve. Lillard against Kitty. Takes the three. Boston with a rebound. They'll take on the Pacers at Gainbridge Fieldhouse after this one. It'll be their second game of a four-game road trip. Back to White. Es de dos. Bien. Lo hemos hecho de maravilla para que se quedara White solo. Como dos bloqueos. Ah. Se ocupa de ella. Bobby Portis. Giddy against Lillard. Giddy passes to Ben Carroll. Rebounded by the Bucks. Otto Kupo's got his fifth rebound. No, no, he's not capable of anotar delante de Antetto. Ah, he's made. Pass to Prince. Giddy against Lillard, and here is Otto Kupo over Ben Carroll. And it's on to Kumpo with the miss. If they just continue to dominate the boards, guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team. Bien, banquero, punto número trece para él. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, BA. Hey, little exclamation point. Hey, they've got a nice, comfortable lead here, fellas. Might as well keep it simple. Do it a plain, simple one-hander, just like pound cake. Yeah, just hasn't been able to find his rhythm offensively, and that's having a ripple effect. Back to MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Punto 33 para mí. Whenever White sees an open teammate, he's getting the ball to him right away. Vamos a mirar cuánto nos falta para lo de Larry Pájaro. Llevamos 36. Necesitamos hacer 92. Ya podéis sumar. Nos queda muchísimos puntos. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. They rushed off the defense. They could really use a basket. Muchos puntos para Larry Pájaro. Ana de Cumpo outside. Portis with it, covered by Mobley. Six on the shot clock. Let's go to Prince. 
Ahí va a jugar Lilar. Oh, Bar, qué canastón de Lilar. No, ¿por qué me la pasas? ¡Vete no. a White, que está solo! ¡Sí! Bien. Pena que no sea mi asistencia. Venga, nos hemos ido a 14. Yo llevo muy pocos puntos, pero a veces pasa esto. For Boston, they've gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. MP, the pass to Giddy. Lillard against MP. Van Carroll with a screen on Lillard. Late clock, the Celtics got to hurry here. And Van Toma el pick and pop con banquero de triple. Montero's got nine assists now tonight. Milwaukee has got nothing. Estamos haciendo mucho daño. No con mis puntos, con los de mis compis. Vamos a ir a Prince, menos mal en este lío de piernas. Camón en pi. Se le ha ido a Mobling. Ah, me como el bloqueo de Allen. Y meto el triple lejano por fin y hacemos un goat y nos vamos a 20. Vamos, 2 de 6. No, perdón. 2 de 8. Llevo 2 de 8. And the 2K leaderboard, looking at the best when it comes to field goal percentage. You look at MP, topping the chart with his efficiency. And of course, Alper on Shangun. The shooting has been phenomenal from both of these guys this season. Just look at the percentages they're making. Hola, qué canastón. Pero desde cuándo meten esos canastones estos? And a valuable piece in the rotation, Clark. Grace and Allen can really shoot it. Love his accuracy from behind the arc. Very efficient in his offensive game. And when he keeps himself under control emotionally, which he's done much better and much more. Pero ya me están haciendo marcaje doble. He's a really good player. Portis gets. Otro triple de Portis, pero pero cuánto tiene de triple Bobby Portis? Que lleva dos de dos. O sea, cuánto tiene de triples? Tiene setenta y nueve. O sea, no es lógico. O sea, que Lilar los meta, pues bueno. Tira 200, pues, pues bueno. MP, the pass to Van Carroll. Oh, Van Carroll takes it down. Yes, sir. Paolo Van Carroll rising up. Paolo Van Carroll. Que por cierto, Italia creo que ha que ha quedado eliminada. No lo he visto. Rebounded by the Celtics. Mobley's got 15 rebounds here tonight. So far this quarter, he's been out of sync and might be pressing right now. Back to Giddy. MP outside unloads the shots. Toma. Sí, sí, pero pero llenan las venas. Oh, and that's just good positioning by MP on the play. He's right where he wants to be to take that quick shot. Lillard against Kitty. Fires the three. It's rebounded by Ben Carroll. Ben Carroll's got six rebounds here tonight. To the inside. Good D by Alonso. Alonso, Alonso, Alonso will bring it up for the Bucks. 
Well, when this one's done, they'll be off to Miami, taking on the Heat. And that'll be their only game on the road before heading back home. Nope. Ah, MP, no good. good. Ooh, that's a tough break. After poor communication defensively, it leaves him all by himself. Allen, the pass to Lillard, takes a three. Lillard! Oh, there's Lillard expect? here. A genuine oh, there's Lillard from here. downtown. Lillard's confidence is what makes him so dangerous. Here's MP. Yet another bucket. Once again, he's reached the 40-point mark as there has been no slowing him down this year. And with all these 40-point performances, he is close to matching the mark for third most 40-point games in a single year. Portis finds Lillard. There's contact, but Lillard. Pero qué está pasando con Lillard, por favor? Pero qué está pasando con Lillard que lleva 28 puntos? Ha metido seis triples, seis de 20. No es que sea un buen porcentaje, pero se tira hasta las zapatillas, pero. Mobley outside. The shot off that time. Oh, great D that time from Portis. You know, even though they have the lead, you can tell he's frustrated with himself that he's not doing more. Se ponen, se ponen a 14. Estaban a 20. Took it right to the rack. Boston has gotten three of six threes to fall in the third quarter. Stolen. Mierda. In transition. Here come the Bucks. Lillard against Mobley. Pass to Portis. Kicks it out to Anadokounmpo. From outside, off the mark. At some point, you need to know when to stop no. shooting. Just too many misses piling up for him. No. Most games he Dos can knock it down from deep, but it just isn't there for him in this one. Lillard passes Dos de diez es peor que el 6 de 20 de, de Lillard, eh? Que conste. Han hecho muy bien el pick and roll y se ponen a 11. Superb initiative from Antetokounmpo. I mean, that may be something we overlook, but being able to take that initiative allows Se ponen a 9. A 9. Nos han bajado 11 puntos. That's a good way to shrink the deficit. Strong defense turns into easy offense. Pero qué ha pasado? The Celtics Salón de la fama. Bagley's checked in for Portis. Clark comes in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Jackson, he's checked in for Prince. And it's Highland in for Allen. Shangun checked in for Boston. Drew Holiday comes in for White. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Brandon Clark. That'll be a second foul of the game. Brandon Clark. MP against Jackson. To the paint. Here's Holiday. No. Oh, that one's off. Still out of sync. The Bucks Pero cómo trail. es posible que falle eso Holiday? Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a better. Van a poner a oh, siete. All right, guys. What do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Celtics? Pero qué qué racha llevan. Hemos pasado del 86-69 al 86-78. Me queda más remedio que meterla yo. No te lo comas, banquero. Back to Lillard. Four three. It's rebounded by Banquero. Banquero's got eight rebounds in the game. They are just owning the boards right now. And that's been the key to this lead. I mean, they've really dominated the glass. Jackson against MP. Shot clock at six. Shangun a screen on Lillard. Here's Montero. No. The rebound by Jackson. It does not get much easier than that, but somehow he came up empty there. Here's Highland. And the three no me puedo creer que metan ese triple. Va a ponerse a seis, tío. Da igual lo que hagamos. Oh, and the dunk by 
Estamos a 8. No me lo puedo creer. Estábamos a 20 y estamos sufriendo ya otra vez. Y ellos metiendo lo que les sale de las narices en el triple. Bagley passes to Clark. Right wing. Lillard against Holiday. Five to shoot. And here's Clark for three. Rebounded by the Celtics. They led the game at one point by 20. And Carroll. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Si lo mete nos ponemos a 10 Si mete los dos Venga Mételo por favor Paolo Venga Pues no puede No decir eso no puede entrar Van a hacer pick and roll, Holiday Banquero. Van a hacer pick and roll, Holiday Banquero. Esa es la jugada. Ah, pues no. Menos mal. Ocho puntos. No me está gustando nada ¿Cómo va esto? Y lo de Lo de Damien Lillard es es, es, es es increíble Esa fue la falta de Anteto no me está gustando nada esto. Bueno, sacamos la segunda de Anteto. La primera se la saqué yo. Mete los dos, Banquero, por favor. Bien. Pero ¿qué ha hecho Holiday, por favor? ¿Qué ha hecho Holiday? Es que no me lo puedo creer. MP against Clark. Montero, the pass to Galloway. Anadokounmpo grabs the board. Banquero, ¿dónde estás? Pass to Highland. Here's Bagley. Jackson finds Anadokounmpo. Fade away. No good on the shot. The Celtics with the lead. Ah, no me ha atrevido a tirar. MP looking around. Now Shangun. Ooh, good finish at the rack. And Shangun, vámonos. Diez otra vez. Esa era la jugada de Machula, eh? No la he hecho. No he pedido yo el pick and roll. ¿Qué hace Brandon Clark jugando de alero? No. Sí. Hielo en las venas. Y cojo un rebote. No. And so Ben Carroll will bring it up for the Celtics. They lead by 11. Shangun, the screen. Here's Montero. Shangun passes to MP. Ben Caro outside. And the Celtics sí. three. His third triple of the game. A little more success from out there in the second half. Hana de Kumpo, a screen bien. on holiday. Shot from 12. Las machuladas nos han salido. 
For Boston, they've gone three of four in the fourth and looking confident on offense. Clark against MP. Shangun a screen on Jackson. Montero the pass to Holiday. And the Celtics. She wow. the opponent is doing a tremendous job spacing the floor. Tres triples seguidos de los Boston Celtics. Ahora de Kumpo surveys to the inside. Yo no puedo cubrir a Brandon Clark. O sea, yo no puedo cubrir a Brandon Clark. El Brandon Clark este mide 203. Me saca. Me saca un. un yo, yo mido 1,98. Pero peso 97 kilos. puesto los cascos. Galloway. Es que no me puedo creer lo que está haciendo Lillard. Ay, me he equivocado. Creí que quería pasarse a Giddy. Jolines. Eso es, a Giddy. Aquí ya está descolata. Shangun, a screen on Allen. Six to shoot. And there's the rejection. In transition, here they come. That's good from Jackson. On the assist by Allen. Great teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. That is the perfect fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. Oh, and a fast break for the Bucks. Oh, and Giannis. Se acaban de poner a 11. Vamos a ver si nos relajamos un poquito. No estropeamos lo que hemos hecho hasta ahora. MP outside. No. Three pointer, no good. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three point line. Left block shot on the way. Ay, se me ha ido. Touch on the bank shot. Se acaban de poner a 9, o sea, es que esto, es que estaban a 15. ¡Oh! Pues acabamos de activar un goal. Vaya canasta de Anteto Cubo. Down low. Back to MP. Pero ¿por qué me la devuelves? From deep, Giddy. La 14. Sí. Bien. ¿Cómo restribuimos el juego? No, vamos a mirar luego cuántos, cuántos puntos. Ay, hemos hecho una falta tonta, ¿eh? Porque me he metido yo donde el pivot. ¿Cuántos puntos nos faltan para lo de Larry Pájaro? Pues si fueran 52 nos faltarían 40, pero son 54, nos faltan 38. En este partido no va a ser. En el siguiente sí que lo haremos. Así que cuando acabemos este partido nos van a poner como partido clave el siguiente. Giddy passes to Montero. Pass to Holiday. Mobley with it. Launches it. 
¡Toma! Oh, oh. Venga, nos hemos ido a 14. De compañeros a cubrirnos, Janis y yo. Bueno, qué locura lo de, lo de Lillard. Lleva 28 triples. Qué fácil. Sí, sí, me ha contado como asistencia. Ah, Teto, entra, entra. Entra. Mobley grabs the board. Mobley's got rebound number 17, if you can believe that. No! Qué mal he tirado. Qué mal he tirado. Bagley finds Portis. Donna de Kumpo inside. MP's there. Such a wide open look. Decision making. Pero ¿cuántos lleva Lilar? Ya, pero Lilar lleva 7. Allen lleva 3. Pero es que, ¿qué tanto por ciento de, de triple? O sea, ¿cuántos triples llevan todos? 3 y 2, 5. Y 2, 7, 8, 9, 16 triples. 16 triples. Nosotros 13. Oh, Sobre todo tirando yo como estoy tirando yo de bien, vamos. And they double up MP over to the wing. To the paint. Here's Bancaro. Ooh, good D by Bancaro. And so Ana de Kumpo will bring it up for Milwaukee. Ganamos de 11 nada más. Es que esto se puede perder en cualquier momento. ¡Oh! Boston shooting has been great. 57% and finally. Ah, otro tiro malo, por Dios. ¿Cuánto llevo? 3 de 14. Si es que Uh, qué partido. Hasta Lillard. Back to Ana de Kumpo. Now here's Portis. They double him with MP. Good chance here for Ana de Kumpo. Another one falls. Se ponen a 9. ¿Queréis emoción? Pues aquí está el partido emocionante. No en otro canal, no, en este está el partido emocionante. Es que es, es desesperante, pero estoy falla, he fallado 11 tiros de triple. Es que si los hubiera metido, ya habría pasado a, a la ripájara. Prince has checked in for Bagley. The Celtics also with a sub. White's checked in. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Ali LaForce. Hey guys, during that last break I heard from Adrian Griffin as he talked with the team. He said to them, you guys look defeated out there. Este también ha sido Allen, ¿no? But I need you all to believe that. I need you to fight for one another right now. Bueno, Guidi acaba de hacer un Juan Palomo. Yo me lo como y yo me lo guiso. Yo me lo, yo me lo hago y yo me lo como, Juan Palomo. ¡Ay, el griego! Como me reventaba cuando yo estaba en los Milwaukee Bucks y hiciera esas cagadas. Hasta adentro, banquero. Joder, banquero. Eh, 6 y 2, 8. Se ponen a 8 a falta de 255. Milwaukee has gone 3 of 6 from downtown so far in the fourth. Portis with a screen on White. Here's Allen. And a great assist Se ponen by a 4 a 6, perdón. Adarcupo's got his assist totals piling up. 11 now for him tonight. 
Giddy against Lillard. Giddy passes to White. Just five to shoot. And Carroll finds MP. Wing shot on the way. Perfect. Toma. Canastón. Carroll's got 53 points. You know, the really good players in this league, the great players, understand the value of the mid-range shot. And that's why MP has it in his arsenal. Here's on it Acumpo. Out to Lillard. Let's the three fly. Ah, que lo mete. No. A cinco. Whenever this team needs a big shot, he knows how to get one. Prince against MP. And Carroll with a screen on Prince. And Carroll outside. And they double up MP. Shot is up. And another Toma! That's another dime from him. He's tallying them up fast, BA. Lillard against Giddy. Yes, it's good. Anacupo's got 20. You know, feeling very comfortable taking a big shot when his team needs it. That's a, that's a sign of how Anacupo has matured recently. And then Carroll gets it to go. Such Bien, a banquero. Le vale, banquero. Le vale. Pero hemos tenido dominio de equipo en todo el partido. Again, on Kumpo missing. Well, Grant, this game looks just about over. BA, all they really need to do is just work that clock, don't turn it over, and this game is a wrap. There's 37 seconds left in the final quarter. Montero, the pass to Ben Carroll. Mobley outside. Here's Giddy from the arc. Anadokounmpo grabs the board. And this is exactly... Ellos se ponen en dominio de equipo. He just missed it. Oh, and he Uf, menos mal que no ha sido dos más uno, porque me hago pis. And, you know, Antetokounmpo antes ha tirado y los ha metido. Es dangerous down inside, really. I mean, the defense has to be physical with him if they want to have a chance at preventing him from scoring in the paint. Se van a quedar a seis. Both good from the line that time. There's 21 seconds left in the game, and so they foul intentionally. Second team foul. 20 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. And he commits the intentional foul. La quinta. At the line for the Celtics. MP. Two shots. Hace tres años gritabais MVP cuando estaba ahí, eh. Ahora me pitáis. Ahí está, metemos los dos. And it's a seven point game. Those are critical foul shots. Love to see them knock them down there. Timeout called. Milwaukee. They're losing by seven. 19 seconds sí. left in the fourth quarter. Y nos vamos a quedar a un partido de igualar el récord de puntos de Larry Pájaro. Un Celtics mítico. El número 33. 19 seconds left to play in the fourth. No. Down the trifecta. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Y Tauro yeah, Prince se va a su casa. Ahí al barrio que sea de Milwaukee. You can't be happy with fouling out, but the game seems out of reach anyways. Se han puesto a cuatro, es que es que es que He drops the first one and that puts him up five. Uf, no os oigo gritar MVP. So he gets them both, and it's a six-point ball game. Timeout called. Milwaukee. He hecho el avioncito. He hecho la, ¿Lo habéis visto? He hecho el avioncito. A ver dónde está. Que se ponga en Montero. Banquero, Montero. Veréis, he hecho el avioncito. No, ya tengo captura para la miniatura. Mirad, mirad cómo he hecho el avioncito. Mira. Uh, uh, uh. Vamos a ganar este partido. Además ya se han quedado sin tiempos muertos. Y 
Here's Highland. No good on the quick three. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high impact. Didi, tienes que meter uno, eh? And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to go. Que te mandamos a Chicago. And he's able to hit the second one. Ha metido uno. And that makes it a seven-point lead. Pero no tiene tiempos muertos. Podía haber sido al revés, mejor, eh. Haber metido el primero y haber fallado el segundo. Three, Allen. And knocks down the three. Se acaban de poner a cuatro otra vez. No, no pienso fallar. Yo no fallo. Pasan los años, durante muchísimos años, y esto sigue siendo una táctica cuando los partidos siguen igualados. La táctica de hacer faltas y los tiros libres y los triples. ¿eh? Pues les hemos ganado de 6 a los Milwaukee Bucks. Y por cierto, ahora todo el mundo a ponerse teledeporte para ver a España clasificarse para el preolimpi, para el olímpico. Puedes echar un parque si quieres. Vale, pues no. Parque. Claro. No. 59 puntos, 17 asistencias y 70 y 59% de tiro al campo. No quiero saber lo de los triples que hoy ha sido desastroso. Me salen partidos de, de 8 de 10 y otros partidos. Hay dinerito para comprarme zapatillas. Con la máxima dificultad, 1 por 6. No se puede jugar más difícil en este juego. Y no hemos hecho... Eh, eh, dominio de equipo, eh. No sé qué ha pasado, que no hemos hecho dominio de equipo y nos hemos quedado a 30 puntos de lo de Larry Pájaro. Ah, bueno, hemos hecho el desafío estadístico de la NBA, eso está muy bien. ¿Ves? Ya nos han puesto el próximo partido como Coach Warren. O sea, el próximo partido también es clave. Ah, no, no nos lo han puesto clave. Oye, pues... Eh, bueno, espera, vamos a hacer las cosas bien. Las cosas hay que hacerlas bien siempre. Nos salimos de aquí. ¿Vale? Para darle tiempo, porque en este momento lo que hace la máquina es simular todo lo que tenga que simular del día. De partidos, lesiones, José Félices... Lo que haga falta, ¿vale? Y ahora... Cuando el juego me devuelva el control, ahí ves que abajo a la derecha está grabando. Vale, ya me ha devuelto el control. Sale la publicidad de 2K. Y ahora es cuando le damos a jugar el próximo partido. Y ya nos lo han puesto clave, porque podemos hacer lo de la ripájaro. Vale, que ya sabíamos que eran eh, un montón de puntos. Eran. ¿Cuántos hemos dicho que eran? Llevamos 21.762, teníamos que llegar a 92. Nos faltan 30 puntos. Con que hagamos 30 puntos en el próximo partido, está hecho. Eso lo vamos a hacer, ¿vale? Entonces, ¿cómo, ¿cuánto dinero tenemos? Como estamos a puntito de conseguir zapatillas, ¿vale? Eh, si miramos las misiones, tenemos el aspirante a jugador callejero, podemos ganar 750 pavillions. Vale, entonces nos vamos a cualquier pista... Nos vamos a cualquier pista. Eh, ¿Cuál es la más cercana? Sunset Park, que está ahí al lado. Ah, nos vamos a Sunset Park. Nos vamos a Sunset Park. Que gente va al estadio. Nos vamos a Sanses Par y desafiamos al jugador de la semana, que no sabemos quién es, pero será alguien buenillo. Punk. Vamos a Sanses Par. Esquivando paredes. Como Irene. Es. PG. Bueno, nosotros cubriremos al malo. ¿A 
aquí ponemos a Chicago Beef y aquí ponemos a 5-0 o al Yeti. ¿Cuánto mide el Yeti? El Yeti mide 2-13. No, igual nos ponemos nosotros con Paul George. Claro, nos ponemos nosotros con Paul George. Si es de 89 y nosotros somos de 99. Venga. Espera. ¡Qué pasada! Os, hoy, os doy la bienvenida. Cuidado con el cable. Paul George, que por cierto es nuevo jugador de Filadelfia 76ers en la vida real. Bueno, a ver si ganamos el partido. Hay que ganar el partido. No se trata de hacerlo espectacular, se trata de ganar el partido, defender un poquito a Paul George. Que no se te vaya. El clipereano. Que no se te vaya. Ay. Podías haber tirado, estaba solo. La cuestión es que no se te vaya. Y de un bloqueo. Uf. Dos veces ya. Ya se nos ha ido dos veces. El indicador de ventaja está al máximo. Bueno, triple. No puedes irte de Paul George. O pides un bloqueo o no puedes irte de Paul George. Pero pásalo. Ocho minutos. Al partido de España. Todo el mundo sintonizando teledeporte y animando contra Bahamas. A ver si sale un partidazo de Hernán Gómez. Bueno, de los hermanos. De Aldama. Que se lo merecen. Ay, Dios. Qué calor, me está dando mi muñeco jugando con chaqueta. Pero ¿por qué haces eso y no lo haces normal? Era canasta si pides un pase normal.
¿Pero dónde vas? A ver, a ver, a ver. ¿Dónde vas? Es que ¿por qué has dejado de cubrir? Joder, macho Es que no... Maravilla lo que acaba de hacer por Dios. <risa> Perdón. Joder. Qué desgracia. <risa> Primera asistencia. Y Paul George se hincha a meter puntos. Si no le cubrimos... Eso es canasta. Qué buena asistencia. El Yeti solo no puede fallar. Qué brazos tiene el Yeti, por Dios. Me he enamorado de esos brazos. Lo que me costó ganarle en, su, en el desafío suyo para que jugara con nosotros. Triple. Eh, ha mandado a dormir a Paul George en pi. Venga. Bueno, claro, si le dejamos tirar, pues nos la devuelve. Lógico. Puedes encender el primer eh, el primer dominio de tiro con la X. Porque no vas a hacer el mamba. No. A dos puntos de ganar el partido. Hay que defender. Paul George tiene el cagómetro altísimo. Se está haciendo caca. No oléis la caca de Paul George. Que huele Clippers. Harden. Oh, qué mal estamos defendiendo. Bueno, es que no estamos defendiendo. No. Pero no vayas al rebote. Tú no puedes ir al rebote porque no tienes rebote. Entonces pasa esto. ¿Qué hacías en el rebote? Pero que tú no puedes coger ningún rebote. Ahora sí. Desafío hecho. Poquito de emoción. Y The Beef se lleva la última canasta. Pero nosotros nos hemos llevado tres asistencias y un 100% en tiros triples. Ahí está, moneditas para comprar zapatillas. Pues con todas las moneditas yo creo que podemos comprar zapatillas. Podemos comprar las Tatum 2 que nos faltan de comprar. Hemos hecho el, la misión. Sí, hemos hecho la misión. Pues ahora si somos capaces de ir a la tienda de Jordan ya sería la leche. A ver si alguien sabe dónde está la tienda de Jordan. Eh, por aquí no. Muy, por aquí no. Uh, ¡Eh, qué bonito! Eh, ¿Derecha o izquierda? ¿Derecha o izquierda? Derecha. Derecha. Ahora izquierda. No queda más narices. Hay que cruzar el río. O el agua o el supu. Eh, I'm lost, estoy perdido. Hola. 
Sí, porque a la derecha hay un muro como una cathedral. Where is the Jordan? Shop. ¿Dónde está la tienda de Jordan? Jordan. Mira qué coche tiene ese pavo. Yo quiero un coche de esos. Converse, Puma, New Balance. ¿Dónde está la tienda de Jordan? Está aquí la tienda de Jordan. Venga, quiero mi State Tune 2. Las Elite Camp, ¿dónde están? No, aquí no están aquí. Estas son las oficiales. Y aquí están. Estas son. Mirad qué bonitas. Es que no me digáis que no son bonitas. Con iluminación LED, con luz negra. Es que son súper bonitas. No las voy a comprar. Porque me gasto yo mi dinero en lo que me da la gana. Ya tengo mis 100. Pues eso, las vamos a poner ya para el próximo partido. Las vamos a poner para el próximo partido. Vamos a cerrar el directo porque hay que ver a la selección española. Hay que ver a la selección española. Hay que ver a la selección española. ¡Oh! No me digáis que no son bonitas. No me digáis que no son bonitas. Como las hemos diseñado estas en el diseñador de zapatillas. ¡Oh! oh, oh. Bueno, pues hasta aquí lo vamos a dejar. Bueno, espera, vamos a ir a. Eh, ¿Dónde está el metro más cercano? El metro más cercano está ahí. Vamos a ir a cerca del pavilion y lo dejamos. Hoy ha sido un buen directo, emocionantísimo partido contra Milwaukee Bucks, mi ex equipo. No hemos llegado a los puntos de Larry Pájaro, pero en el próximo partido contra Indiana Pacers, que no teníamos intención de jugarlo, nos obligan a jugarlo. Lo conseguiremos porque solo nos faltan 30 puntitos y 30 puntitos en un partido. Aunque perdamos el partido por 200, nosotros lo hacemos, ¿vale? Bueno, pues eh, aquí lo dejamos. Eh, os vas a ir a suscribiros ahí, pulsáis, os suscribís, os llega la campa y ponéis la campanita y tal y no os perdéis ninguno de mis directos. Ahora animar a España, a la selección española para que se clasifique para el Olímpico, ¿eh? Hasta.